Republican Senator David Osmek of Mound is proposing a bill that would increase the penalty for drivers using a cell phone and causing a crash that results in injury or death. Does this solve every problem with distracted driving? No. Would I rather go after the person who's digging for the last Cheeto at the bottom of the bag and injuring someone or yelling at the kids in the back seat and hitting someone? Yes, I would. But I can't get that done. You have to get done what you can get done. The bill also would increase a fine for texting while driving from $50 to $150 for the first offense, second offense $250, third offense $500, and impounding of cell phone. Lawmakers are also proposing bills this session that would ban cell phone use behind the wheel unless it is hands-free. And that bipartisan hands-free cell phone bill while driving that is proposed at the state capitol has the support of V.J. Dixit. Dixit lost his 19-year-old daughter in 2007 when she was killed by a distracted driver. He says the time for change is now and calls it a no-brainer. Don't give an excuse. Oh, I'm a very great driver. I don't get hit. I don't hit anyone. No, you will get hit. And I'm not giving you as a threat, but I don't think there is anyone who would like to stand like this in four or five years and talk about their loved one who was lost to a distracted driver. Lawmakers are proposing bills this session that would require drivers to use their cell phones in a hands-free mode and that would increase the penalties for the texting if someone is killed or injured. I'm Dwayne Etienne reporting for rjbroadcasting.com.